What is up guys? My name is Mark Santamaria. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the RC vlog. Of course, more packages come in. We're gonna open this package up before we get on with this vlog. This one's from Proline. Nothing crazy exciting about this, but there is something different about this package. And I'll show you guys. Ah, here we go. I'm scared. Oh, I'll probably just stab, stab. <laughs> I just probably stabbed through a shirt or something. Oh, here we go. So, all it has in here are just a bunch of tires, needless to say. A bunch of tires. But, the short course tires, I'm out. Best short course tire around, the M3 Proline Hole Shot. This tire works everywhere, and uh, at least everywhere that I run. The only problem is it wears down a little faster, but you will always be on pace with this tire, so basically I just stock up on M3 Hole Shot. Sometimes I'll use a blockade if the track is really low me, but I don't typically run my short course until after it gets really, really um, grooved in, or after the, the dust is already kind of worn off, so this is an awesome tire run, M3 hole shot, but more importantly, they got a new wheel. So I use Proline wheels, needless to say. I'm used to using the F11s. Um, this is the Impulse. Let's see the difference. So here's an F11. I don't know if you can see that. Um, you can kind of see it just a little bit. There's a little, you can see a little bit of difference. Um, between the F11 and the Impulse, so I got Impulses. I couldn't find the F11s, maybe they stopped selling them, but Impulses it is. But that's that, that's that uh, that package. But I got some more stuff to talk about, guys. Um, I, I I checked my phone because I gotta show y'all something. I had a whole bunch of people saying, you know, my uh, Rustler 404, this car right here, uh, Wrestler 404 VXL is on eBay right now, and I'm going to pull it up and show you guys what it's at right now. I had a lot of people skeptical that I was going to get my money back on it. I bought it for 200 bucks. I rebuilt it. I thought I was going to sell it for maybe 275 It hasn't sold yet. It hasn't sold yet, so I don't want to jinx myself, but I'll show you guys what it's at right now. It is at... Here we go. 265 guys it's at 265 and that's 265 plus shipping because I have $30 shipping so technically it's at 295 right now 295 I get it I'm gonna have to pay a lot of fees it's about it's a roughly 9 to 10 percent fees for eBay and then you probably have maybe a 3 percent fee for PayPal and then I gotta ship it so there are gonna be fees but I still think the amount of money that you make or how much the difference that you make on YouTube will cover those fees. So 295 freaking insane. But on to what this vlog is actually about. I bought a new RC car, guys. I am so excited about it. I we're not going to see it. We're going to see it in this vlog. We're not going to see it right here because right now it's about 9:40 at night and Oh, there's a reason why I'm on my phone, guys. I'm not checking my phone while I'm talking to you guys. It's about 9.40 at night. And I, I can't go to the hobby shop, but it's sitting at the hobby shop. This is just a sneak peek. Sitting in the box at the hobby shop. I'm going to go pick it up tomorrow, which will be right about now. We are here at Indy RC World in Garland, Texas, and we're picking up my car. I'm so stoked. Super stoked. Let's go check it out. All right, here it is. Boom, all right, let's go, let's open it up. I'm gonna have to set y'all down, cause here, let's see, let's see what we look like. I'm, I'm gonna set y'all over here. Here it is, guys. We'll, we'll open it together. We'll, uh, we won't, we won't look at that. We won't look at that, that's, that's a giveaway, you ready? But before I show you, no, I'm joking. Here it is, boom. I did it, I got an E-Revo, guys. If there was any time to buy an E-Revo, which is still a time to buy an E-Revo, but if there was any great time to buy an E-Revo, it was in the month, or not even the month of April, but April and before, they went on fire sold them. They knocked them down $50. They're trying to basically just compete, not compete with blowout with Arma, but coincidentally, when Traxxas lowered the price of the E-Revo 2.0, Arma's prices went up. So remember I told you guys I was gonna buy a new monster truck and bash around with it. And with that whole thing happening, 
um, I went ahead and ordered an E-Revo. So I'm gonna pull it out here because I think I got the green one, but if I got the orange one, it doesn't really matter. That doesn't bother me because either way they're awesome. All right, so I'll give you all some shots of the box here. Nothing crazy. So one thing I noticed about the E-Revo 2.0 is they've got a new ESC and motor. So the old E-Revo 1.0, the very first E-Revo, it was actually, it was expensive. It was, I think it was $6.99, it retailed for $6.99. So when they came out with the E-Revo 2.0 and the price point it was, I think it was at $5.50, it shocked everybody. It was like, whoa, they made a newer one, a better one, supposed to be a better one. And uh, it's, it's cheaper. So again, I think that was more of a, a ploy to try to compete with Arma, but apparently this new ESC and motor is at actually, it's actually Traxxas. It's not Castle like the way it used to be. So I think they probably saved some money, money there with the licensing. Again, this is all just what I'm speculating. I don't have any actual facts behind what I'm saying right now. The other thing, it comes with the regular shocks, um, these shocks, and I'll show you the, the car whenever I pull it out. Um, it comes with the regular shocks. Um, it doesn't come with the GTR shocks, but the GTR shocks were freaking awesome. They came on the original Revo 1.0. So whenever I get, I'm not going to open this thing yet because I've got way too many projects. Again, I want to finish some of my projects before I actually start um, busting these things out and playing with them. I also want to order some new Proline rubber for this car. So hopefully... The Proline rubber will come in stock. I've already put it on order, not order, but notification on order. So whenever it comes in, I'm probably going to get the uh, Badlands. So yeah, whenever that stuff comes in, I finish my projects, I'll bust this thing open. I'll do a side-by-side -side comparison between the E-Revo 2.0 and the E-Revo, original E-Revo. So there you have it, guys. It's my new car, the Traxxas E-Revo 2.0. I'm going to hop this thing up. I want to put all the cool accessories that I want on it. Um, again, that's going to be a project after I get done with all the crazy projects I have now. But it's going to be there. I'll put it in the pile of brand new cars I have at the house. If you like this video, guys, smash that like button. Subscribe to my channel. Turn on the notification bell. And you guys will see me next time. Later, guys.